cab is over here sitting on the ground. Use the cherry picker and a come along up in the tree. On the inside, the cab is looking kind of bare. No dash, no door panels, no seat. There is a back seat. There's a speaker box. There's a toolbox. Headliner still in. I might should take this in the woods. Maybe I should put it on that little, here, let me shut the door. I think better with the door shut. Maybe I should put it on that little trailer and make a camper out of it. Hmm, something to think about. The cab camper is now sitting on the trailer. And what's neat, that orange ratchet strap right about here came out of that toolbox from the white truck. There's another orange one in the back that did not come from that toolbox. I think I, I think right now I'll go get my mower and see if I can pull it around in the yard. Eventually pull it in the woods and we'll camp in it. That looks like a camper to me. Maybe a three person camper. And the blocks are not ideal, but that's what I've got. On the farm, they should be fine. If we ever go on the highway, I want to change those blocks out. Shut 327 right here in the custom truck bed trailer parking lot. And if we pan over a little bit, there's a custom truck cab camper. I think I'll hook this behind these two, behind the truck, make a longer train. I'm thinking blue truck, white trailer, green trailer, white camper. That'd be backwards having the cab behind the bed. Let's make it happen. Well, you missed it, but the third one is hooked up too. Truck cab camper, ready to pull. Figure eight's out in the field. The truck bed train just got a little bit longer. We put the custom truck camper on the back. I'm gonna go get the drone and get some bird's eye footage of it. Maybe some more figure eights. Right here on the custom cab camper, and I've got the toolbox. It fits between the angle iron perfectly. Inside the toolbox, a blanket, a net, a lighter fluid, hot dog buns, marshmallows, bottled water, there's my backpack, a couple ropes, there's my chair, uh, and some charcoal. I'm gonna take the steel wheel grill, put it here, and I'm gonna head over to the campsite.
We are right here in the custom truck cab camper. And there's not a whole lot of room if you're tall. Short people, young people, it'd be really good. There's one here, one there. There's a bench seat that we're sitting on. There's five of us in here right now. Count the legs. One, two, three, four, five of us. Uh, it'd make a really good fort or an emergency shelter if you were freezing outside. And if you want to, you could get a battery, wire this thing up, and you could have lights in here. The windows could roll down. I think most of us are going to try to sneak over to the van to sleep. It's a lot more room. Truck cab fort. I got out, and there's still five people in there with the lights on. It's pretty funny to me. I need to get in the van real quick while they're all stuck up into the truck cab. It's like a disco party in there. Van has a love seat in the front and a pull-out couch in the back. That's where I want to be. These sausages are ready, and I'm ready. Life hack, I cut the sausages in half. That makes more of them. Makes them more hot dog size. This is the hot dog. I mean, this is the ketchup mustard stand. Nobody likes mustard. Sophie doesn't want it. She says she's. What about yours? No, I don't like it. Okay. It's sour. I'm gonna get mustard by her, but yep. Okay. Because it's sour. Mm -hmm. It's sour. Mm -hmm. And then the boy has gone up in the tree to make some light shine down on us. That's pretty neat. And he falls out, he's going to be in big trouble. And if he falls out, he's going to be in big trouble. Hey. How is, how is he stuck to the dam? I don't know. I let on and the campfire is up and running. I let on him. It is marshmallow roasting time. You're on the marshmallow cam. <laughs> That's fairly roasted pretty good. Time to eat it. 